Hey guys, welcome to Drupal Learn. Today we are going to see how to export the content type from one environment to another environment. Let's get started. And as you can see, we have two environments here. One is Drupal Learn stage and another one is Drupal Learn. And we are going to export one of the content types from Drupal Learn to Drupal Learn stage. Let's go to content types here. Now we have the new content type and if you click on the manage fields, there are multiple fields. Now we are going to export this content type to this environment. Now there are multiple options uh, through which we can do this. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to do this with the custom module. So let's go ahead and fire up the terminal first. Let's go to Drupal Learn directory and uh, let's also open the uh, Drupal Learn, Drupal Learn stage directories as well. And then we open an, another environment, another terminal. So now Drupal Learn stage directory here. Now, uh, what we are going to do is we are going to export this particular content type on Drupal Learn environment. Let's do Lando Rush Config Export. So this is going to export this particular content type. As you can see, these are the fields, and this is the YAML for the actual uh, node type, and these are the form display and the view display rules. Let's Yes. Let's check its status. Now we will need all these files actually. So let's copy this. Supply. Space this. What we are going to do is copy all this YAML files. Into the directory of to the custom module. What is it? Directory module custom. And DLAM. We're going to copy all these YAML files into the custom module of the second environment, as you can see, Drupal Learn stage. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and open the module directory here. Stop. Be done. Now we'll create a config. And install directory here. Create install directory here. 
and let's fire up it. We will move all these config files inside the install directory. Let's just drop this. Let's just drop everything inside the install directory. Just running this. Okay. Now. Let's go ahead and enable this module. This module upon installation will actually create the particular content type. Now the module has been enabled. Now if you go to content type and refresh, as you can see, the content type has been created and the rest has been created as well. Now if you try to add a content, you can see the content time. Thanks for watching guys.